What's going on, guys? It's XRP Vel here. Twitter in the description, Patreon in the description. Buy me a coffee link in the description. Merch in the in the description. Watch this video to the end always. Leave a comment. Thousand comments, thousand likes. Let's get into it. So, the United Arab Emirates, right? <clears throat> they basically you know, switching to digital, right? So with that being said, they issued their first digital payments uh, license. So this is coming after, you know, uh, a Ripple taps into United Arab Emirates, right? So after they made the deal with them, about a couple months ago now Qatar issues first digital payment license okay in the United Arab Emirates so the Middle East has gradually been uh, accommodating right from different parts of the world into its digital sphere Ripple's partner Trangolo recently announced its expansion into the region last week the cross-border payment processing hub opened a new payment corridor in the United Emirates, okay? So, notably, the Arab Gulf region emerged as a key region for cross-border digital payments post-pandemic, all right? As reported earlier, the United Arab Emirates is one of the top remittance senders and receivers world worldwide, okay? So, in 2020, the country recorded 42.7 billion and 6.78 billion remittance outflows and inflows, okay? Here is worth recalling that the Qatar Central Bank announced last week that banks in Qatar are ready to officially launch the mobile payment service Google Pay after completing the necessary tests, notably all global digital wallet services for cards, for cards like Apple Pay and Samsung Pay are now accepted in Qatar. Okay? So, now you see how they're using like they're talking about like Apple Pay and stuff like that. So, you know, they're starting to accept that over there now. And uh, like how, how we, you know, we have Apple Pay here in America and stuff like that. So most likely that's how the central bank digital currencies are going to be rolled out. It's going to be through, you know, Apple Pay through the phone. You know what I'm saying? And then we could just do it through the phone, the, the CBDCs. But unfortunately, for some people, it's not going to work out for them because, you know, I'm going to have my ledger and I'm patiently waiting for the ledger visa card. So, as you can see, everything is starting to transfer, you know, to go digital because it's more convenient. But uh, thanks for watching. Peace out.